The fog has rolled in on the manzana. Down there is the confluence of the manzana and the Sisquak. Wow, the fog is just really <laughs> thickening up. Everything is so wet out here. Here we are. Well, we're on our way home. First water crossing five minutes after we get started. Looks like one swimming hole there, and one swimming hole there, <laughs> and maybe a deep spot right there. Oh yeah, that looks like a good one right there. <laughs> and creek crossing here, and a deep spot here. This is a swimming hole at Horseshoe Bend. There's people camp right up there. A little bit of swimming hole time before the last couple hours home. There's the swimming hole, one of them. Right there, yay. Well, we're leaving Horseshoe Bend. A lot of little campsites. Oh, look, it's got a sign now. It's got a name. I've never seen this sign before. No. Yeah, that's awesome. Horseshoe Bend. Somebody build a swimming pool for cold water camp. They built a little dam. Well, we're on our way to Portro Camp. Oh, I'm getting tired. I'm gonna walk out of here with no food. All I have left are four 
instant coffees. I have no milk. I have no, no other food. I don't think I've ever done that before where I've walked out with no food. But there's still like about an hour, hour and a half to go. And then it's, uh, the shade is nice and the sun is pretty hot. It's still beautiful out here though. It's so wonderful. I wish it wasn't ending. More little dams to make little pools at Pachero Camp. So, in a way, the Sisquak Loop is kind of like the Wonderland Trail because it's like a circumnavigation of Hurricane Deck. You go all the way around Hurricane Deck and it's full of wildflowers and the beauty. This is where we parked at our campground. We're reminded of the apocalypse that we left with all the people hiking wearing masks and trying to socially distant, distance on the trail. But it looks like everybody's like, get me out of the city and into the nature. Oh my god, I smell chicken. I'm so hungry.